everyone out there in internet land. That is one of the last times I'll be able to say that on this particular vlog. I've been thinking for a while what I wanted to do in my last Wofford Experience vlog. Having this Wofford Experience vlog has been such a huge part of my actual Wofford experience. I wanted to make sure it had a proper close. I then came across this piece written by Marina Keegan. She just graduated from Yale and unfortunately and tragically she passed away last Saturday in a car accident. But she wrote this piece that was part of a special edition of the news for their commencement exercises and I came across it online and it was so beautifully written. I'm going to link it below because everyone should read it. It's, it's really good. She begins by saying, We don't have a word for the opposite of loneliness, but if we did, I could say that's what I want in life, what I'm grateful and thankful to have found at Yale, and what I'm scared of losing when we wake up tomorrow and leave this place. And that is basically how I've felt for the past few weeks leading up to leaving Wofford. My freshman year just ended. It's crazy. I couldn't even believe my freshman year was ending. I stayed at Wofford as long as I possibly could. I stayed for graduation. And when my mom and dad came to pick me up, I locked my door and my mom started pulling the door closed and I was holding it open because I just, I saw the door close as the door closing on my first year at Wofford and it was just really sad. I can't relive my freshman year again. That part of my life is over and it was, scary and crazy and it happened so fast. I found this opposite of loneliness. I found such good friends and people that I know I'm going to keep in touch with for the rest of my life. It was just really scary that this year was coming to an end. And like Marina writes, I'm scared of losing this web that we're in. This elusive, indefinable opposite of loneliness. And I started to think that that was what my whole vlog was going to be about the craziness and scariness of my first year at Wofford coming to an end. But then Marina writes, let's get one thing straight. The best years of our lives are not behind us. They're part of us and they're set for repetition as we grow up. And that's what I realized. Things are only getting better from here because even though my freshman year was great, my sophomore year is gonna be even better. This isn't a sad goodbye message. This is a happy realization of the incredible sense of possibility that lie before me and all of my peers. I am so excited for what lies ahead. And even though I'm alone right now, and I've been alone in most of my videos, we're all in this together. We're all moving forward towards a much better tomorrow. I'm gonna end my video with a quote from one of my favorites a Mr. Theodore Geisel, also known as Dr. Seuss, who said, don't cry because it's over, smile because it happened. And I will smile. It was an incredible freshman year. And I'm gonna keep smiling because I know that whatever is going to happen is gonna be so much better. It's been an honor being able to share my thoughts with you on the internet. And I am so thankful to have had this opportunity. So thanks for being a part of my Wofford experience. And like Marina said, let's make something happen in this world.